Olá! Olá! Are we on? We're on. I'm Luke AK, this is Yachty Boy, and we're going to be starting a little art video series to get us through these crazy lockdown times. Do you want to get down? <laughs> Today, we're going to be sitting down, doing a few drawing exercises to get us warmed up, and we'll be diving into a bit more of a solid art piece that we'll go into after we're warmed up. First off, we'll just gather up what we need for the day. So we're probably going to need some pencils, pens, rubbers. We make sure we got what we need. We don't have to go find stuff halfway through drawing. So for me, got my lucky cat pencil case with a couple of pencils and pens. I've got a reference image that I'm going to use for our warm-up drawing. And I've got my black book. Alrighty, that'll be it for our warm-up to get us started. We won't clutter the space too much. And we've got a nice little space with a lot of light. Got some plants. We've got a, a drink that's going to keep us going for a, at least half an hour. And, of course, we've got the trusty sidekick, Yachty Boy. Before we sit down and start drawing, we'll crank some beads and uh, loosen up. Dive into Run The Jewels' new song. Alright, so we're feeling pretty warm. Let's sit down and uh, dive into some drawing. Let's get ourselves a new page here. Pull out Lucky Pencil from the Lucky Pencil Cat. <laughs> Lucky Cat Pencil Case. So diving into our first exercise, we're just going to do a rough little sketchy drawing, get the creative juices going and just dive on in. Doesn't need to look good, this is just a warm up. I guess one of the hardest things with drawing is coming up with an idea and one of the easiest ways to get you going is just to copy something, find a photo that you like. Uh, a cartoon, could be absolutely anything and just sit down and copy it and draw it in your own way. It could be an exact re replica or you could take some personal inspiration and go completely wacky on it. Draw this little bad boy, bit of a guitar. Wow, wow, wow. Most of the time when I'm drawing I would have like a podcast or music blasting just to kind of get me out of my head a bit and kind of find some flow. Absolutely go for that if you find that that works. If not, just go whatever feels good for you. I was going to do a one continuous line drawing, but I kind of got a bit bored of that. It felt a bit stiff and I just kind of went with the flow and made it go real doodly. And this really is just a scribble, just to get things going. We're not trying to paint the Mona Lisa, so don't overthink it too much. Just 
go with whatever comes out of your hand. I like drawing flames. It's a pretty nice fluid motion while you're drawing it and kind of makes everything look pretty badass. So flames on a guitar, why not? There you go. <laughs> Quick little doodle to get you warmed up. Doesn't have to be pretty, doesn't have to look cool. It's just to get you going. Don't overthink it. Just scribble it out and we'll move into our big piece where we're going to be all nice and fresh and loosened up and ready for something amazing. We're ready for our big piece and we're going to put a little bit more effort and care into this one so it won't be as doodly as a little warm up. Um, so what we're going to need is a pencil to get us going, give us our basic outline, then we'll fix her up and add in some colour to make it look dope, to make it look bright, fun, and epic. More adjectives please. Alright, so the subject for this drawing, we listened to a bit of Run the Jewels in the little dance off. So we're going to draw one of my favourite artists, hip hop artist, and all around legend. Mr. Killer Mike. Usually take a photo or any kind of reference image. It could be on a computer, it could be in a magazine. Wherever you find it doesn't really matter. But we just kind of want to get the basic outline down first and then we can dive into detail. The good thing about the pencil is you can go as sketchy as you want and then we'll go over it with the coloured pencils and it'll get hidden away. Yeah, don't be scared to make mistakes. Make it as sketchy as you want. You could work with that sketchiness or you could cut it back with a rubber and find the real line that you're after. However you get there, just get it down, get it done. I wouldn't even say you need to get everything in proportion or true scale. Like if it's all wacky, it kind of adds to it. We're not, we're not trying to create photo real stuff here. It's about finding style, finding your style. Here comes the fun part now to see it all come to life, adding in that beautiful color. So you see me throwing in the beard texture and I'm just doing little squiggly lines. It can be that simple. Squiggles are good. I'm just using one highlight colour here. I'm going to use this golden yellow that you see on his gold chain. I'm going to use that to highlight different places on his face, on his t-shirt. Then I'll also use white to really set that those highlights off. Nothing too crazy shadowing with a black you don't really need to fully block out color over everything just banging in a few few more highlight details just to set it off that little bit more there we go just wrapping it up, uh, I guess the only thing left to do now is put your little signature on it. So 
whatever you, you've created, sign her off and send her in. I'd love to see what you guys have created out there. Can be anything, can be a drawing, can be a painting, whatever you're going for, send it in and we'll showcase the best ones up on localartistdivision.com and keep tuned for the next episode where we dive into something else. This has been Drawing With Pencils and hope you like our Killer Mike rendition. Peace.